Alright, welcome to yet another Sun Team. Random team this time, because I couldn't find anyone on the smoke on all your sites. That said, let's hope for a non Ubers, right? Huh, I mean, close enough, right? Also, I don't believe I'd beat a Luxray. Um, but I have switches for Luxray. Let's see, starts off with. This couldn't possibly get worse. This is an awful start. The chomp. Or I guess he got it right, but for me, that this is a terrible start. I'm string sapping on his potential attack. Out oh, speed. Yeah, that's not better. <laughs> Fuck. Because Stone Edge and he misses. Huh. Right? He is supposed to outspeed. He is definitely supposed to outspeed me. Yeah, you're getting popped here, man. I am lying. He's doing all the popping. <laughs> um. Wow, yeah. That's kind of impressive. Strength staffing again. <laughs> no! <laughs> Goes into something I can use? Maybe. Ooh. I don't work like that though. I don't work like that. Nom nom nom. How much can I recover even? Oh, yeah, yeah, we're good. We're back, baby. We're back. Um, he's gonna absolutely go for an electric move. Or, I mean, I would. My best play is still, like, outslowed in essence anyway. He goes for... Yeah, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Bit of a shaky Wi-Fi, I feel. So on this scenario, do I want to... Um, no, I go for a Stone Edge. I do the safe play on the possible floaters. I think even I kill Garcha with a Stone Edge. Goes into... Ooh. Alright. Yeah, I'm feeling the in-game team. And... Yes! Nope. Denied. <laughs> I like Joyce Bandit right period. It is an absolute threat, though it probably was a bigger threat in Sword and Shield. Mainly because the best mods couldn't necessarily beat it. Oh yeah, yeah, this guy. I remember. Ugh. Thing is, I do have an opportunity of actually hurting it. I'm just not there. Like, he could go for an Aura Sphere, I think. And if so, then so be it. I just want to draw it really. <laughs> Let's see. Flash Cannon! Kinda nice to get that play right. Um, now, the Alga. Steel Dragon, which means... Well, it means I have a very tough time, but it also means I'm switching out. He has to have Earth Power. Or just go for a Draco directly, just finish me off, basically. Let's see what he decides to do. Agent... Oh! This Charizard cannot catch a break! This is like the third time I switched it in, and it just dies instantly on the switch in. It happens far too often. This is awful. Not again. <laughs> oh, I pity him. I pity my freaking Charizard. Fucking booting him from the team already. It's it has been done. Now flash cannon should not be um it should hurt. Oh oh what? The fake sash? Let's go! <laughs> what? Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> hell yeah, what? 
Oh, like a boss. That's um, that's kind of impressive. <laughs> oh, that's weird. That's weird. All right, I'm absolutely sacking here then. I do it, do it. I can take it. <laughs> what the hell was that? Let's see. One more turn of of life. Probably gonna go for the strongest move I got. Come on, my fleur. By the way, that is French for my flower. That's how creative I am. Yeah, like he has to sack it. And I'm pretty sure, due to Victory Bell's insane amount of power, then that this should not be a problem. Get wrecked, buddy. <laughs> um, that said, though, I mean, the sunlight is out. Driftblim did outspeed the guard champ, but I think that is as far as I'm willing to stretch it. Yeah, Infernape. This guy is a thing, though. And I'm gonna boost his fire moves. It's not gonna help me a lot. But basically, like, Victory Bell could probably wrap up this game if I get it in correctly. And to an extent, so could Torkoal. <laughs> Ooh, you did it. He did the play. He did the play. How much will it do? We, we took the Quar right, actually. We took the Quar right. Still though, I do want to keep it somehow. Oh, Quaken, just to get as much damage in there as possible. He could close combat or clip Blitzen. It's a good boosted move for him. Like it's not a bad play per se. And I inherently lose the matchup, so I lose so much HP, so I have every reason to think I need to, uh, like, re-gauge myself. Let's see how many turns of Sun do I got left, anyway. Don't have the info. I think it's two. Yeah, Zodiac. Don't necessarily need you healthy, I just need you to maybe reset the Sun before we go out. Let's see. Close combat, right? I got that play right. That works. Right, it is time, Infernape. Your time is now. Now we know you're not scarfed. Which definitely was something I was considering. Right, there we go. If I were my opponent here, I think I would bring Empoleon, right? Unnecessarily evil. Because he's the devil. And I can't do anything besides a uh, fire blasted sun move, which probably works if I connect it. Yes! Boosted! <laughs> oh, no, 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 Bro, it just kills, right? That's that's nothing to it. Nope. <laughs> you don't see them running flash cannon though. And my son no, not my son. Though Hindenburg, the flaming blimp is here to wrap up this game. I mean come on. Remaining mods don't deal with this guy at all. By the way, a little history lesson, like Hindenburg is the biggest like blimp who ever existed who exploded in New York like in the 30s it was on fire which is probably why I think it got the um, <laughs> its ability the flare boost I am pretty sure of it like it's such a what do you call it such a dark turn for the mon itself but that said Drifflim did it Though I would not have thought it could against the guard job, but hell, here we go, checking it like no other. 
So that's it guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and this battle and I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care everyone, alright? Bye.